Optimizing your site searches features can skyrocket your conversion rates and sales. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to add, customize, and remove the Shopify search bar. There are two ways to add the search bar to your store. One is through the Shopify store itself, and the other is with a third-party app. Now, the issue with adding the search bar in the Shopify store is that it can't always be done and not all themes support this. On the other hand, an app such as FastSimon will always be quickly and easily added to any theme. Let's go through how to first add a search bar to your Shopify store. Make sure that you are in your theme section and on your live theme click customize. Under your theme settings, you are going to be able to look for the search option. You can enable or disable search. Now it's different for every theme. So make sure that you just poke around and you can decide if you want people to be able to search collections, blog pages, etc. The more preferred way is to use an app like Fast Simon. You can customize almost everything in your search settings with Fast Simon. One of the great things about the app is that you can manage how your products and your collection show up. Let's go ahead and go to the configuration page. With Fast Simon, you can add, did you mean? So on your regular Shopify store in that search, sometimes if somebody makes a typo or if they talk about flowery dresses and they really mean maxi dresses, you can't do that in the regular Shopify store search, but you can do it in Fast Simon. So you can toggle that on or off. You can also decide if you want content like your blogs or articles to show up. You can also toggle that on or off. If you've created a site that is also kind of a how-to site, let's say you sell cookware, but you also have a lot of recipes, you might want to also have your content search toggled on. The other great thing about Fast Simon is that you can have your products sorted by customer rating. Let's say you're using a product reviews app like Vera or something like that. You can definitely sort by customer rating or you can sort by price low to high or high to low. The options are endless when configuring the way products show up in search for your customers when you use Fast Simon. Depending on your theme, you can also decide if people can search collections or search products or search blog articles, but you don't have that same level of detail that you do with Fast Simon, for example, sorting by product rating or sorting by price. Now let's talk about how to remove the search bar. So in your theme, you can just enable or disable search, and it's as easy as turning off the check button. And you can see here that the little search um, icon has disappeared. Now, if you want to remove the search bar using the Fast Simon app, you can definitely do that. It's just as easy as uninstalling the app. To uninstall the app, just go to your settings and then apps and sales channels and go ahead and click uninstall. And there you have it. Now you know how to add, customize, and remove your Shopify search bar. You can find the links to download the Fast Simon app in the description box below. And be sure to head over to our website for more tips and tricks and to keep up to date with the latest e-commerce news, innovations, and ideas.